some of you might ask yourself, why is this happening to this guy? By now, I'm sure you believe me. It's pretty straightforward, okay? It has to do with the nature versus nurture debate, evolution and development, the stages of development in life. So write this down, okay? Nature is the determinant in the absence of the alpha nurture themselves. In other words, if I don't raise you or train you myself, okay, you are going to be too immature to serve God. Again, I tell you, if I don't train you in martial arts and life myself, you're going to be too immature to obey God. Okay, so it has to do with moral, mental, spiritual, romantic precision. How do I train? Right? So it's my dad, two brothers, right? They didn't come out the same way as me. My nature was to extract the nurture and do it the right way, okay? Now, when I look at it and I look at my brother and say, what did they do wrong? I can learn from my dad's mistake and then convey masterfully to people how to be somebody of God. So let's look at the word play. Again, we have anagrams, we have etymology, linguistics, cut-ups, occult word play, play, right? Hidden in plain view, esoteric. Uh, we have symbols as letters, the H is a primitive symbol of defense, and so on and so forth. We have numbers coinciding with letters. A for alpha, one. A is the first letter, the one. It's shaped like a knife, it's a pen, a phallic symbol, and so on and so forth. Okay, so we look at the word mature. Vowel, vowel to L, okay? Interchangeable vowels. Also phonetics, Phoenicians, you know, and so on and so forth. Right? Who's doing this to a bunch of gay people? Phoenician, Canaanite, kind of Babylonian system that migrated to Greece and Crete, secret society, secret society. So the word play argument is sound. Alpha, bet, con, and consonant, okay, uh, letter, right? Who's letter, you know, let her do it, right? Kind of let her, okay, and so on and so forth, right? So we look at, uh, you know, and of course, vow, L, okay. We look at the word mature, okay? So we can get A M R I T A with the interchangeable vowel principle. And when we use phonetics, we get M right A. I'm the right alpha. So I'm mature enough to say, hey, you know, I'm the true alpha and I should leave. And the other person says, looks at this and says, you know what, he's right. He's the true alpha. He's the top martial artist. His family history, you know, his brain surgeon father who came here as a refugee, relative, not Ben Carson, some big martial art line, brain surgeon, his body structure, all these things, all these things are signs, miracle, my so they're, they're mature enough to say, hey, you're the right alpha, you're, you're, you're in charge, okay? And to give up this kind of worldly stuff, you give up whatever career they have if they're older, give up their toys and so on and so forth and just commit to doing the moral thing, right? Jesus said, sell your possessions, except for, I'm not saying sell your possessions, this is the end and we need to kind of gather resources and we need to take a stand together and discuss these things as mature adults Seems I'm the one mature and so on and so forth. Anyway, so we also get the M right O. The O is the reproductive cycle, like a cult. They're saying the reproductive cycle, O C cult. And they want you to see things their way and reproduce their way, have sex their way, secrete and secretion society. Okay. Uh, and of course, M tear M tear E. The E is the Sumerian temple. It's the baby line. Okay. So they didn't develop quickly. Now, this is an example of when I was younger, okay, when I was 17 years old, I was ready to die for God, ready to take a martial art life, ready to go for true love. So at 17 years old, I was more mature than they are when they're 80 and 90. Look at Rockefeller, for example. He was very old when he died, David Rockefeller. He wasn't mature enough to give up his evil path. So I was more mature than he, he was when he died, okay, all the way through his old age. When I was 17 years old, okay, and this is, this goes for everybody. When they don't fall in line with the right alpha, it's a lack of maturity. Think about the principles they need: moral well, moral courage, moral maturity, okay, moral clarity, mental and moral acuity, clarity, okay. And they, when they don't have these things, they're not mature enough to accept the spirit of God. And after I'm gone, nobody mature is going to teach them. And these people have decided to have kind of teenage, erotic, desire, perverted, porn magazine, reading uh, ninny kind of sex and lives and how the sexual energy uh, affects your life and, you know, your flow and so on and so forth, okay? They're not mature enough 
to do it the supernatural, divine, God way. So they label themselves gods, they worship pagan deities, they come up with their new interpretations and new stories and new movements, and they just build on their baby line, Rothschild, immature nonsense.